get back to that peaceful march we talked to you about in demonstration that started on the north side this evening. Past the city's curfew, in fact. Uh, WGN's Eric Rung's been with them all afternoon and evening. He's live with the protesters tonight. Eric? Yeah, good evening, guys. We are on Clark Street uh, heading toward downtown. Uh, we haven't seen a heavy police presence uh, for quite a while now. There's actually just about a half dozen that I see behind us. We're at the rear of the pack as we've been following uh, this group all afternoon. Uh, earlier today, they had stopped and rallied at different places, uh, different intersections, but so far, they haven't stopped marching now for quite some time. And this uh, all got started around 2.30 this afternoon. All right, well, it started at Belmont and Sheffield with a moment of silence, and then they were on the move from there, and they marched uh, north all the way to Sunnyside and Broadway. Now, once they were there, they again had a rally uh, many times, taking knees. There were several moments of silence as well, and they were all saying over and over again, make sure to say his name, George Floyd, of course. Now. Devonna Levine was telling officers exactly why she fears police, not far from that big rally and police officers, uh, and why she fears them being an African-American woman. The officers listened, and quite frankly, that's all she wanted tonight. And then she decided that she needed to give him a hug. But I'm human first. We all we human all have lives. We all human. That's all that counts. We all human. I don't care. We're all human. Protect us like y'all protect y'all family. Because if it was one of y'all, protect here, us like y'all protect y'all family. Y'all probably would have went and took off your uniforms on your coffee break or something. Now, not long after that rally at the uh, Target there on Sunnyside and Broadway, they decided to march down to Lakeshore Drive. They got up on Lakeshore Drive for a while and they rallied at Irving Park there and then they decided to come back west and then uh, all the way to Clark and then now we are heading toward downtown and we have been on the move ever since. Uh, as I mentioned, there is a contingent of Chicago police officers that are following this group as they make their way toward uh, downtown on Clark Street right now, but they've made no attempts to even inform them of the curfew. It doesn't appear that that is uh, going to be in the cards. Obviously, there's just not a whole lot of them here. Now, uh, earlier we did see quite a few police officers, but this has been very, very peaceful all afternoon long. Uh, there's been absolutely no issues uh, that we have seen um, uh, throughout the afternoon. We're going to